Details in the sexual harassment case against Michigan State football coach Mel Tucker. The woman making the claims through her attorney releasing a new statement on why she went public. The letter says Brenda Tracy had no intention of publicly disclosing her identity. She was and will continue to comply with the internal investigations. So it says she respected this process and did not go to the media to preserve the integrity of the investigation. But listen to this, in a little more than three weeks, Tucker may learn his fate. He is suspended without pay right now. Whether he is fired depends on Section 3 of his contract, which covers termination and says MSU must have cause to fire him. A Cooley Law professor questions if these allegations fall into that section. If it comes back that he did not violate Michigan State's code of conduct, which would be a feather in his hat when it comes to this discussion as to whether or not there's cause for him to be terminated, I don't I I, I just don't see any way that he keeps his job. Tucker has denied the allegations. A hearing is scheduled for October 5th to determine whether he did violate the school's sexual harassment and exploitation policy.